She is 51 years old. She is mother of four children, but she looks like a top model. Rania al Abdullah is the Queen of Jordan as a wife of King Abdullah II. She was born into an ordinary Palestinian family and never expected to be queen. But her life has turned out incredible. How did a refugee girl get into the royal family and became one of the most powerful women in the Arab world? Why does she look so young? Is it true that she had a facelift? And how much money does she spend on her fashionable outfits? I'll tell you the amazing life story of Rania Al Abdullah. You are watching WOW Channel. Rania was born in Kuwait to Palestinian parents. The girl grew up on the West Bank alongside her two siblings. Her father was a doctor. The family lived in good conditions. But they were not of noble birth. At that moment, it was impossible to imagine that Rania would one day become the Queen of Jordan. She never dreamed of becoming the wife of a king. Since childhood, she studied a lot and wanted to make a career in business. In youth, Rania decided that she wouldn't wear a hijab. Her parents supported her decision, and the girl was always sure the main thing is what is in the head and not what is on it. Rania was educated at the New English School in Kuwait City before enrolling at the American University in Cairo, Egypt. She received a degree in business administration. In 1991, the first Gulf War began. It was a big tragedy for many Palestinian people. Rania's family also was forced to flee from Kuwait to save their lives. They started new life in Amman, the capital of Jordan. Rania moved there with her parents. After a brief stint working in marketing at Citibank, Rania accepted another marketing job at Apple's office in Amman. It was a sad and difficult period for the family, but who knows how Rania's life would have turned out if she had not moved to Jordan. The girl was incredibly beautiful. She was invited many times to work as a model, but she refused, as she dreamed of a serious business career. In January 1993, Rania accompanied an Apple co-worker to a dinner party. This event was thrown by the sister of Prince Abdullah II, Bin Al Hussein of Jordan. He was also at the party. Ordinary girl and young Jordan prince met each other. It sounds like a fairy tale, but it was love from first sight. The eldest son of the king was a real Jordanian playboy. Many girls dreamed of becoming his bride, but he had fun almost all his youth. Abdullah had no intention of becoming king because his father appointed his brother as heir to the throne. The young crown prince noticed an incredibly beautiful Palestinian girl and fell in love. He married Rania just five months later after first meeting in 1993. The wedding was amazing. The ceremony took place at the Hram Palace in Amman. Rania was wearing a white European-style dress. Abdullah was dressed in military uniform. At that moment, no one knew that they were the future king and queen. One year later, their first son, Hussein, was born. Rania and Abdullah were a happy married couple. The young mother didn't want to become a queen. She dreamed of a quiet family life. But fate turned out differently. In 1999, King Hussein unexpectedly named his son, Prince Abdullah, as his successor. Six years after wedding, Abdullah became a king, and Rania became a queen. Announcing her coronation over state television, King Abdullah declared that his wife's non-royal origins made her better connected to the hopes and outlooks of people, since she truly believes in their causes. Rania had youth and glamorous beauty. It instantly made her something of an international icon. She attended high society social events with her husband and became very popular because of her good look. She used her rare beauty not for fun, but for more important things. Queen Rania became a powerful advocate for reform in education and public health. 
the development of a sustainable tourism industry in Jordan, youth empowerment and cross-cultural dialogue between the West and the Arab world. She is not just a wife and a mother, she is a progressive female voice in the Arab world. Abdullah and Rania have been living together for almost 30 years. They raised four children. The oldest son is 28 and the youngest is 17. The king and queen still look like a couple in love. He listens to her ideas, they feed each other's intellectual curiosity, they are a perfect match, two people very comfortable together, who think along the same wavelength, said Prince Zaid bin Raad, a childhood friend of Abdullah. Queen Rania is 51 years old, but she looks like a top model, perfect skin without wrinkles, thin waist, thick long hair, any young girl can envy her. Rania has long been a fashion icon. She chooses outfits that combine European chic and oriental modesty. Rania chooses outfits from famous designers, but she never discusses fashion because she prefers to talk in interviews mainly about social work. Rania names her style modest fashion. She wears long dresses with long sleeves that cover her body. But at the same time, she emphasizes a thin waist and looks elegant. Queen of Jordan is among one of the best-dressed royals in history. But it comes at a price. According to the blog Unidentified Fashion Objects, UFO no more. The cost of Queen Rania's clothes amounted to more than $481,000 in 2017, based on estimates of what she wore. However, the royal family has officially stated that this amount is overestimated. In the post, it stated that most of her clothes were either loaned or presented as a gift. Rania always looks stunning and in really good shape in all her appearances. Queen of Jordan reportedly follows the GI diet, which stands for glycemic index diet. The eating plan, also known as the low glycemic diet, is based on how foods affect your blood sugar level. That's why, at 51, she has a waist like a young girl. But the most incredible thing is that Rania, at 51, doesn't have any wrinkles, absolutely smooth young face. Is it plastic surgery? If you compare all the pictures of Rania with photos of today, there is no doubt that she has changed the shape of her nose. In old photos, her nose is much larger. She probably had plastic surgery. Now her face resembles a frozen mask, too smooth for her age. Her huge beautiful eyes turned into narrow slots. Her latest photos are less emotional. I guess she has done a facelift, but was there a real need? She has always been beautiful regardless of the age. And what do you think about Queen Rania? Please don't forget to share your thoughts with me. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, give me a like, comment and subscribe.